my god. I have so many things I need to do. What happens when you get overwhelmed with things, guys? What time is it? Shit! I got it. Okay. <gasps> I forgot to put up yesterday's laundry! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! I have to re-wash it now! Oh. My life is falling to pieces. <laughs> oh, no! Everything's over. It's over. It's over! Uh, how could you let this happen? Because I put the laundry in before stream in the morning, like at 12 this morning, and I forgot! I'm having one of those days, guys. Every Nothing is going to plan. <laughs> She's a mess. She's a mess. Oh, what a mess. That's what I like about me best. Ugh, are you gonna get a dryer in your place? I've just figured out how to properly use the dryer. I've been experimenting with the dryer function of this washing machine. <laughs> I didn't realize... Yeah, I, I think I figured it out how to use it. <laughs> but it's also like, I'm not used to using dryers. I never grew up with a dryer. So I don't think I'm going to buy a dryer. Um, or even a washing machine that has a dryer function. I just don't... I, I'm not used to it. I didn't know people still air dried things. Well, I guess it just depends how you were raised. If you grew up with a dryer, then all you know is a dryer. But on the flip side, it's kind of the same thing as a dishwasher. I also have a dishwasher at my new place. I'm very ecstatic, but I wonder if I'm actually going to use it. <laughs> I might, but I don't know. I've never used the dishwasher. I mean, I've used the dishwasher. Oh my god, this is a funny story. I used the dishwasher once at an Airbnb, and I broke it. <laughs> I've never seen the inside of it. I didn't even know what it was. I thought it was just a regular cupboard, but we had the trash bin in front of it. So I was like, wait, is that like, it's not the wall. What is that? So I asked Mama Rat, and then she was like, oh yeah, we, are, we have a dishwasher. And I'm like, what? You've never seen a plate enter into that. I've never seen the inside of it. I've never opened it. I don't even know if there's anything in there. Do we use it as storage? I don't know. I have to figure out this. I have to figure this out before I leave forever. But that's my goal. Um, I am going back to Australia um, once. Just before technically the, the big move. Because I need to get the rest of my stuff. Before I leave my shed. My, my Aussie shed. I need to see the inside of that dishwasher just once. I need to know what's inside. Anyway, so that's the context. I never grew up with the dishwasher, okay? A lot of the times, I, I didn't even know that there were things that you can't put in a dishwasher, okay? Because we just hand washed every any everything and just dried everything by hand, okay? Now, the story of how I broke a dishwasher. Uh, I was traveling. I was staying in an Airbnb and they had one of those dishwashers that were connect that was connected um that you pull out. It's like it's like a drawer. But it's like a smaller one, you know. It's kind of similar to one to the one that I have in my JP shed, or I will have in my JP shed. But it's kind of like one of those smaller ones that look like that looks like a cupboard, but it's not really a cupboard. So it's not the one that flips out, if that makes sense. You pull it out like a drawer. So me being, I used it like a couple times, and I was like, wait, okay, this is actually very convenient. And this is when I got cocky and I screwed up, and I decided to try and jam as many things into this dishwasher as I could, including the wooden chopping board that I decided to lay flat on top. <laughs> so I ran the cycle and, uh, you know, I heard the ding, the finish of the, of the cycle, of the dishwashing cycle. Ding, ding, ding. I go to open the dishwasher, unload the dishes and put everything away. I did why is it not opening? Uh, eh? Uh, eh? Well, uh, why is it not opening? <laughs> well, the wooden board had gotten stuck at the very top. So now it's jammed to the point where I can't open it. So you know when something gets jammed in like a drawer because you've overfilled it? Yeah. And then I started panicking. I was like, oh shit, what do I do? <laughs> so I had to call a plumber. And he had to saw the dishwasher open. He had to saw through the actual chopping board so that I could open it. <sighs> so after 
a while, I kept pulling at it, and then I got it open. I had, I could open it like a little crevice. It was like a little gap, you know, appeared. And then um, it was big enough to get like a little tiny hand saw in. And he started sawing away. <laughs> And ever since then, I've never used the dishwasher ever again. How embarrassed were you? I was like, I, I just didn't say a word. I didn't say a word. <laughs> Traumatized. Did you tell the owner? Of course I did. Yeah. I mean, I think the dishwasher wasn't broken. It was just broken in that sense where I like, I jammed it. I bought a new chopping board for them because <laughs> I had to saw open. I had to saw their one in two. <laughs> Thankfully, the dishwasher wasn't broken after that. Like, it, it could still wash dishes. They were a little dense at the top, though, but it's fine. This is why you hand wash dishes. I don't know why. If if I just hadn't put, put that chopping board in, none of thing, nothing would have happened. It was just the chopping board. Why did I even think I needed to put the chopping board in the dishwasher? You've hand washed your own chopping board your entire life, eh? Why did you think that had to go into the dishwasher? Sometimes we're a little dumb. Just a little bit dumb. Don't worry about it. Don't put a shopping board into a dishwasher, guys. I asked my girlfriend to cosplay you on Valentine's Day, and it seems I've been blocked by her everywhere. Any advice? I don't understand women. <laughs> oh, God. Ah. Uh, I don't know how to respond to that. On one hand, I'm very flattered. But on the other hand, go apologize to your girlfriend. <laughs> I have no further advice. 